What's going on, everybody? I'm W. And I'm the Thick Baby. And we're going to be bringing you the Battle of the Week. But before we get into it, let me just mention, on February 1st, we have our merch drop coming. It's going to be sweet. It's got us all animated, the whole crew. I'm a Western cowboy. And I'm this big jack dude with a cigar. It's going to be awesome. Can't wait to show you guys. February 1st, it's first come, first serve on all the sizes. So make sure to pick them up while it's hot. You don't want to be missing out on it. So let's jump right into our Battle of the Week. Who do you think would win in a fight? Lex Luthor from Superman or Tony Stark from Iron Man? Ooh, we got two brains against each other. One evil, one good. Two brainiacs, both with powerful suits of armor. Lex Luthor's got money, so does Tony Stark. I feel like Tony's probably smarter on the weaponry than Lex is. He, yeah, Lex just kind of does kryptonite things a lot, I feel like. Lex does don a suit of armor sometimes when he's fighting against Superman that's filled... It's powered by... Why am I kryptonite? Yeah, kryptonite. Yeah. So he, but, his power suit is pretty ripped. I mean, it can take a punch from Superman. This is, this is what I'm going for right here. All right, what you got? Lex's suit is built specifically to fight Superman. He's not going any different. He True. is there to fight Superman, get rid of him, and True. That is monopolize the, the business in Metropolis, all that nonsense, evil empire. Tony's suit is built for every situation. Every time he loses or gets beaten even a little bit, he improves it to go Mark against four, that Mark person. Mark 5, Mark 6. I think maybe Lex gets the upper hand, but in the end, Tony's adapting to it. His suit's better equipped to fight multiple okay. different options. thinking Jarvis is going to come in for the win with him. I'm thinking Tony's got it. All right. That's what I was leaning towards, too, was Tony. Yeah. But let us know what you think in the comments. Yeah. Who do you guys think would win, Lex or Tony? <clears throat> All right. Who do you think would win in a fight? Skeletor from He-Man, Masters of the Universe, Ooh. or Cobra Commander from G.I. Joe? Oh, man. I'm going to have to go Skeletor, hands down. Oh, tell me guy. why. Tell me why. I Give mean, me the brief. First of all, He's Skeletor. The only person that can stand a chance against him is Beast Man. Beast Man? He-Man fights him. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Um, Beast Man's definitely his sidekick of questionable... <laughs> there's something there. There's a romantic entanglement there. Is there is something there. And Skeletor and Beast Man, man, they know what's going on. It's the only person that can take him down. And does Skeletor... Like, I haven't watched a whole lot of He-Man. Does Skeletor have a lot of powers? Um, or is he just evil? He's just evil, and he has that I feel sword. like he's got, like, a sorcery that, kind of thing going sorcery? on. Oh, yeah, he's after the sword. Yeah, he's just got that staff, some yeah. sorcery. Cobra he wants Commander, the sword though. that makes He-Man strong, yeah. and when He-Man becomes strong, he can beat Skeletor. So, is he that great? Yeah, I mean, but is really Cobra Commander that great? Cobra Commander, I mean, he just... He's yeah, he ninja. just runs Cobra. He's a ninja. And he appears to be undying. The man cannot die. True. So basically it's going to come down to their kung fu skills. True. Who's more evil? <laughs> evil. Um, you know what? I might actually change it. I think with the entirety of the like Cobra organization on his back, uh, he's going to pull through. Because he'll have like maybe an orbital strike or something during the fight. Or some sort of like high tech weaponry. I mean, they are, you, they're always high tech. You got too. a point. If we if we're going team off of team for Skeletor's team versus G versus Cobra Commander's team, Skeletor's team, while it may be smaller, maybe more powerful individually, with like the one chick's like a sorcerer or something, and they got Beast Man stuff like that. Cobra Commander's got like literally an army where he could just like bomb them. Yeah. So I, you're right. I think if we're going based off teams, Cobra Commander's got it. Cobra Commander. But you you let us know what you think in the comments. Are we wrong? Thanks for watching our Battle of the Week, everybody. We have merch dropping February 1st. It's first come, first serve on all sizes, and it's got us animated on hoodies on the front of them. I'm a big jacked guy with a cigar. And I'm a cowboy. And then our rest of our team is joined with us. You'll have to tune into our streams to see what that all looks like. But it is first come, first serve, so make sure you get that February 1st. But thanks for watching, and we'll be back with another Battle of the Week next Monday. Peace out, everyone.